In today's world, most acutely becomes problem energy. Today, it is for anybody not a secret, that electricity is a commodity product which determines the possibility of the existence of this civilization. In this film, I want to show how it is possible to do without fuel, charging apparatus for batteries. The most successful variant of this device, in my opinion is a motor generator Vega. But Vega is not without drawbacks. The main disadvantage is the low speed, the booster system. The design of the motor generator Vega, 12 sections coupled coils. In one section, the first motor coil, the second coil generating. Inside the 20 pole synchronous generator of vertical type, 3 phase 380 V, maximum power at 250 red flash minimum 1 kilowatt. On generator flywheel housing, fixing 6 rods with magnets, which form 6 propeller rotor blades. Output power on the battery charge in storage, 250 watts. General wiring diagram looks like. The Vega system applied classic pulse motor. Internal motor winding shunted by a diode. The outer coil generator. It works on the principle of generator Robert Adams. Motor windings are connected by four groups of three coils. Gensets are connected by series. Generator circuit compensates for the cost of motor coils energy. Просимулируем вот эту схемку нашу обычного классического мотора с шунтированием диодов. Ну, смотрим, никакого чуда у нас нет, все работает по классике. Симулятор математически рассчитывает примерную работу данной системы. Особо отличаться она при правильной сборке не будет. Вот таким макаром что мы здесь видим вот у нас потребление из батареи вот потребление из катушки ну, в различных комбинациях немножко будет отличаться но не серьезно спасибо Ну вот, рассмотрим теперь на симуляторе мою схемку импульса. Вот мы ее запускаем, как она работает. Вот теперь смотрим. Потребление от батареи, самый импульс, вольт ампера. В ватах потребление от батареи и э, ватная раскладка импульса. То есть... Вот таким макаром просчитывает нам система. Те же 20 мили Генри, вся та же система, за исключением другой немножко диодной развязки. Все, благодарю. In the circuit self-inductance of the coil no shunting. Self-induction is directed to charge the capacitor 5 microfarads 500 volts. The fifth diode protection which prevents capacitor is charged above 400 volts. Thus, when the next pulse, discharging the first capacitor to the coil, the magnetic flux forming short, 500 watts, after the discharge of the capacitor, the energy taken from the battery is not more than 50 watts. The system has a 500 volts capacitor 5 microfarad. 
limiting diode 400 V, which does not charge a capacitor of 2 400 volts. Three coils, connected in parallel between the transistors for switching the half bridge type. Diodes, set the path of the current pulse and the self inductance, when you turn on and off transistors. The diode is not giving the self inductance to get into the battery. Coils 20 millihenry, and the cross section of the copper wire of not less than 2 mm in diameter. Cross sectional area in the system must be greater than the cross section of the coil wire. One group of three coils, the coil spacing of 120 degrees. The system of at least three groups. The minimum ratio of the road are six poles and nine coils in three groups. the general system of vertical type. All going on the same shaft rod. In the center of the synchronous generator and it has the smallest range between the poles. The generator has, the rotor with magnets, the moving part, stator coils, no movement. The rotor is integrated flywheel, dual deletion radius. The magnets are mounted on the blades, with a triple radius. On the stator coil motor system placed fixedly. Pole coils must interact with the magnets on the rotor blades. Removing the power from the generator is controlled by a thyristor diode bridge. It is important to make the first half wave is not active. The generator does not have a permanent resistance to rotation.